Hey yo, welcome to Denzel's World. Today is Australia Day and the Gold Coast beaches are very crowded right now. Well, maybe not, it's raining. I believe today should be about mateship. Moving on from our imperfect past to a more unified future with deep cultural roots. But I decided to spend today alone. Last year I set the goal to continue my mission to promote local businesses here in the Gold Coast and other parts of Australia in conjunction with reaching 10,000 subscribers by the end of 2022. And so far, it's been a busy start to the year, hence escaping the usual Gold Coast scene. I'm currently at Warringah Pools, one of the multiple scenic spots here at Springbrook National Park. It is a less touristy spot because it is an extra hour's walk just off the Purling Brook Falls circuit. Things to do, you can swim, And you can hike. One of the highlights so far is my first ever official business meeting. A dream five years in the making. Do you remember Costa Taco from episode 132? Gold Coast's most authentic tacos? How do Mexicans say yum in Mexico? Turns out they loved the video and wanted to properly meet up with me. About to have my first ever business meeting. And I am super nervous. Hopefully those nerves didn't show in the meeting. We talked business and spent just as much time consuming tacos. Other than the last time I was here, I was now granted a backstage pass to witness the process in which an authentic taco is made. Overjoyed with this career milestone, I of course told my family about it. Their response, let's eat tacos. I'm wet, I'm miserable, and I wanna go. I wanted to escape the usual Gold Coast tourist scene because I wanted to escape distractions. With my first business meeting being a fruitful one, I expect that the rest of 2022 is just gonna get a whole lot busier. So I wanted to take this moment to reflect on how far I've come in my career. God given talent. That's 17 year old Denzel, who launched a clothing company that flopped, pivoted to study fashion styling, and eventually discovered his true God given talent video. And finally, I've upgraded my gear by purchasing this drone for some extra cinematic shots. I had this particular one in mind that was going to add so much value to this video, but there's too much rain to fly this thing, so I had to improvise. Alright, saving the best of all lookout for last. Oh wow. So you could argue I'm not the best travel vlogger on the internet, but I'm trying. After my pitch to Australia's leading digital media brand for them to produce my personality driven episodic internet show that focuses on travel and food got rejected, I decided I would do it myself. Part of the process includes launching a brand Instagram account. Except for today, when the weather is wet, it's miserable, it always seems to be the case every time I have a day off. But hopefully you still managed to enjoy how this episode's story was told. I really wanted to share with you how exciting 2022 has been for me so far. Taking this day to get away from the busyness and spend time reflecting, I'm now even more excited for how the rest of the year is going to turn out. And I know this isn't a polished piece of content. So if you are wanting polished content, go follow God Given Talent on Instagram at God Given Talent AU. Down good. 